What's up guys? And welcome to a new vlog. So, you know how I like to keep it real. I have no makeup on, I like to keep it real. Anyways, my car has been broken for the last week. I've been without a car for the last week. And thankfully my brother was able to come and save the day. He's been working on it for about three days now. So what happened was it just started spilling out water and he had to drop the transmission and everything to get to a 69 cent part. Yep, it's almost put back together. So that's the good news. So I have my crazy hair. He's under there somewhere. <laughs> yep, this is what he's done. Almost back together though. My poor ground. So with that being said, we were trying to find rides back and forth to school and he came through the first day he was able to take them back and forth to school and then um the next two days one day we had to walk to school and walk back well the first the first day it broke i had to walk all the way to their school and it's probably about two miles to their school so i had to walk all the way there and then my mom came and rescued me and she's like what are you doing walking so as soon as I was to the school, she's like, well, we'll just, I'll, I'll just take the kids home. So then she was able to take the kids home. The kids didn't have to walk. Second day, my brother was here. He was so nice enough to pick them up and take them to school. Also pick them up from school. And then the third day, we walked. The fourth day, I had this car, which is the one that I've been driving before. Oslin's dad wrecked my car, or after Oslin's dad wrecked my car, but you guys, $20 in this will go like a few days, like seriously, a few days and that's it. Okay, no, not even a few days, because I spent $20 in gas for one day. Those cars are such gas hogs, you guys. Anyway, so we just kind of been stuck outside, or stuck at home. The kids have been playing, riding their bikes, getting some outside exercise, um, it's been nice. So, don't mind my hair. My hair is like, I washed it yesterday and then I just kind of threw it up in a bun, but now it looks like crap, because I didn't straighten it. You guys, this is what my hair looks like when it's not straightened. Do you see those little waves in it? I know someone had asked me before, they're like, your hair doesn't look curly or anything. It's like, no, it's not curly, it's just, like, it looks dead, but it's not dead. It's just, I don't know, it has like a wave to it. So it's like so hard, there it goes, see? Do you guys have any tips on how to keep your bleached blonde hair looking nice and keeping hydration in it? Let me know, I did coconut oil the other day and it felt so good and then I washed it last night and I just, it's back to normal. I deep conditioned, I put on a hair mask, I did all that stuff. Just, I just don't think my hair likes me. I don't know. But today is going to be an exciting day. I say that every vlog. Just kidding. I don't know what we have planned. I guess days will go by days. We might go swimming at a friend's house. It's actually one of my uh, my ex daycare babies. I guess would you call that an ex daycare baby? I don't know. One of my friends, little girl, I used to watch. She said that we can come over and go swimming. They're gonna go swimming this evening. So we'll see how that is. Just live like right around the block, which is so convenient. All right, guys. So it's all done about four o'clock now my car blew up so all right guys so like I said they're done we're gonna be leaving here shortly now to go work till like two o'clock tonight just to make up for the week two days working like 12 to 16 hours just to make up for the entire week but y'all know me I'm a go-getter I don't ever stop. Just because one thing happened doesn't mean it's gonna stop me from everything else. So, one bump in the road means more opportunities in the future. That's the way I see it. Ain't gonna keep me down. But I'm so excited, you guys. Mariah's graduation's coming up. She graduates, I think, in three weeks. So we're planning her um, graduation party. It's going to be freaking awesome. 
going to be awesome. He's mimicking me. Is that what vloggers look like? Yeah, that's exactly what vloggers look like. We look psycho talking to a camera, huh? Yeah. Now you came How out here you like vlog? you came out here looking like this, like. Ha <laughs> Hey, <laughs> you jacked my soda. <laughs> you swimming? I'm trying to get closer, but I'm trying to get I'm going to try to go forward. I'm going to take me out. Mommy, I'm going to try to go Okay, you stay close to the edge, okay? You promise me? Yeah, look at this. Okay. Good job, buddy. I'm going to do this. Okay. <laughs> you can jump off. Look, I don't, even, I don't even need the side. Watch. Brennan, Brennan, you need the side. Come on, jump. Brennan, do you need the side? No. Oh, I'm scared. Don't be scared. Look, he's, he's going to jump. Watch, he's going to jump. Watch out, he's going to jump. <laughs> See, your turn. <laughs> I'm a chicken. <laughs> chicken. You guys, she's wearing my swimsuit. She stole it. Sorry, bye. <laughs> Go. Go jump. Oh, Brian jumped in. Can you see everything? No. No. All right, guys. What's up? So we're back at home. We had so much fun hanging out. It's probably like almost nine o'clock, past their bedtime. But we had so much fun. Kids played in the pool. Pool felt nice. It was kind of chilly, but it felt so good just to like be there. And we're all hanging out with all the kids, and it was fun. So that's all for this video. I need to go to work now, and. Pretty much that's it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this short little video and we will see you on the next vlog. Good night.